Oh, it's slow as start as it is. That tone, too. <clears throat> We're doing the recording process the same as we did last year. We set up two mattresses against the wall, and then a microphone, a laptop, a couple of speakers, and away we go. And that's how we did the last album. Don't look at me like that. Actually, do. <laughs> yeah, every time you do good, I wouldn't look at you. <laughs> it's better than doing it in a proper recording studio. Because it's more, like, organic. You kind of, like... Every, every hotel room's different and sounds different. Again. It's me and you, buddy. It's me and you all the way, baby. <laughs> Julie and John, Jamie, whenever we're sat with them, it kind of just feels like we're sat with, you know, other members of the band. It's a big thing sitting in a room and, you know, talking about your feelings and talking about your deepest love and whenever you've got your heart broken, all that kind of stuff, you know. So you have to be able to be comfortable, really, for the good, for the real stuff to come out. What's the best way of saying that? And let's fit it in. We did that when we were young. Well, we were you past that, playing hard to get. We did that when we were young, when we were younger. Yeah. Yeah. Are you sleeping, baby, by yourself? Or are you giving it to someone else? Trying to find you, but I just don't know. Where do broken hearts go? You did something that's so good. You went, uh... Someone else. That was good. I just need a couple of those. Okay. Like, he's got to that point now for me, and I'm deadly serious about writing and stuff and making the songs, and, like, I'm a proper into it now. On the last couple of albums, obviously, I've realised that the boys have loved being involved with the writing, and I felt like I was missing out a bit. So then made a conscious decision to be like, I want to be more involved with that now. I'm enjoying writing the songs and it doesn't feel like work when I go to the studio anymore either. It's like, it's fun. But when you do that that last one, go full. Hi. Just go. go all the way. To actually write the music and, and like turn on the radio and one of your songs comes on and you're like... I know exactly what this song's about, and sometimes they're about the most random thing, right? When we wrote Midnight Memories, we uh, wrote it first about KFC. And it's so funny, first of all, it's just mumble, like we're having a good time, whatever. And out of nowhere, this massive chant erupts, I love KFC, and then it became the song. I recorded it like this. I don't exist if I don't have her. The sun doesn't shine, the world doesn't turn. All right. Everybody wanna steal my girl. Everybody wanna take her heart away. The reason why I feel so much stronger singing our songs now is because they've got us in them, they've got, they've got credibility because they've come from us and it's the way we're feeling. They know who they are, they've been doing this now for four years, they're veterans, they have a clear, you know what I mean, they're veterans now, even though they're 21, like, they know what they want to say, they know where they want to head. Literally, once in a lifetime, just being caught in the midst of a, of a phenomenon, it's just magic.